Oklahoma fans find their beloved Sooners ranked seventh in the nation to begin the 2010 season. And if head coach Bob Stoops' team is going to climb the rankings in the BCS, it will rest on the offensive prowess of quarterback Landry Jones and all Big 12 wideout Ryan Broyles, both of whom had breakout seasons last year that culminated in a magical Sun Bowl performance that resulted in 13 completions and three touchdowns between them en route to an exciting 31-27 victory over Stanford. The 2010 season starts tonight in Norman, and fans of the Crimson hope the celebration lasts until an eighth national title is in the hands of OU. Sooner football is upon us, and it begins right now. And straight up the middle, big hole for Murray to the outside with speed. Inside the 30-yard line. Third and seven from the 12. Broyles, first down, into the end zone, touchdown. Now Smith, the back behind Burrell, and coming across the backfield that time was Williams, and there's Tom Wart in on the stop along with some friends. A lot of consternation about the kicking game for the Sooners as far as the place kickers are concerned. Not so much about this guy, Tress Way. He puts his left foot into it and booms it over the head of Kerwin Williams, rolling down inside the five-yard line. Wow, what a punt. Empty backfield for Burrell here on second and ten. Now he's under pressure and he's hauled down back at the 35-yard line. Now third and long, Burrell with time. That ball's picked. Going the other way. Demontre Hurst. Inside the 30-yard line. Two receivers out left. And inside the 20 down to the 17, Cameron Kinney. That's a first down. This Oklahoma offense this year now they've got some tight ends last year they were right. having to move tight ends like Brody Eldridge into the offensive line and Murray to the outside and he can walk into the end zone uh, we have some returning guys back but it'll be a team that plays hard that plays tough and uh, really competes every possession tell us about the schedule you get to go to Hawaii what kind of job is that and he's the one we talked about earlier the violent hitter right. saw it time and time again on kickoffs last year and there's a hit applied on the outside by Tony Jefferson way had the 85 yarder earlier from his own 11 all the way to the Utah State four yard line put some decent pressure on way that time. There are a lot of seniors starting for Utah State. And there's a mix up down there at the 22 yard line. Texas is looking at the same thing. They've got a lot of true freshmen on their 2D. I think both schools are, are feeding off what happened in the 2008 season. Both recruit so well anyway. Landry going deep downfield, has his man. It's Ryan Broyles. Sooners on the left side of the offensive line at Jarvis Jones at left tackle, Gabe Eichert at left guard. And slipping a tackle is Ryan Broyles. Now 14 yards to Broyles. Now rolling right is Landry Jones. Firing for the end zone. He's got his man. Touchdown, Ryan Broyles. How quickly will they become the players they can become? Third and 10. Ibeloy trying to contain him. But Burrell fumbles the football. Casey Walker can't pick it up. Somebody fall on him. With receivers spread out in Oklahoma with its nickel, nickel package. And bring Moats in motion across the backfield, fake to him, and under pressure and drop. Zero return yards for the Sooners. That's a key for the punter. Lots of running room for Murray, but Jones out in front of him. He goes out of bounds at the 45 yard line. DeMarco Murray, the deep back, Trey Miller, the fullback. And Murray trying to get outside. And Murray, first down, Oklahoma. That's a gimme, though. Second and ten. Running room this time for DeMarco Murray down the sideline. He may go. He does go. Touchdown, Oklahoma. Tressway with Chris Harris deep, as well as Cohen Williams. Taken at the two-yard line, it's Williams bottled up. Marcus Trice is down there, as is Travis Lewis. There he is, number 56, playing at right defensive end. Working on Spencer Johnson, the left tackle, a good one, a four-year starter for Utah State. 
Lofted downfield, and the pass is picked off. Quentin Carter has it, and that's just what Oklahoma needed. Second and eight. DeMarco Murray stretching it out with a stiff arm. And it's 16 of those carries in the first half. Now with 168 yards, and DeJuan Miller can he hold on. The bobble. He's fighting for possession with Gavin Jones. He's got it. John Nemo, the fourth string quarterback, is the holder. From the right hash mark. And not good. It didn't look good, but it is good. <laughs> That's the ugliest kick I've ever seen. <laughs> it still counts as three points. Cameron Kinney, one of the two deep men for the Sooners here. Short kick fielded by Kinney on a hop. Has some running room. Down the sideline, up to midfield, and the hurdles out of bounds at that point. And Oklahoma will have great field position. Sooners take over at their own 40 with 23 seconds left in the third quarter. And the pass is complete to Kenny Stills. It was one of those back shoulder fade type throws. You see that a lot, especially in the NFL. These right. Days. The back shoulder fade has become a very popular pass. Very effective. And the slant is Boyles, and he's thrown down. Solid tackles near the line of scrimmage all night long. Quickly, Jones rolls left, throws downfield. Ryan Boyles near the 10 yard line. First down, Oklahoma. And makes it third and short. From the 16 yard line, they need to get to the 19. And on the quarterback draw, can't get there. Nice job by Travis Lewis. As time fires, a diving catch made by Stills at the 45 yard line. On the 29. With the ball is Burrell, the quarterback. Nowhere to go, but that doesn't matter with him. And it's Tony Jefferson. Casey Walker over center. They'll bring in Blitz. four or five. Burrell gets out. Tipped up. Fleming comes down with it. Was he inbounds? Yes. Huge play by Jamel Fleming. Big time catch. On second and nine, getting to the outside. It's a 200-yard game for DeMarco Murray, and it is 800 all-time wins for the Oklahoma Sooner program. It's 116 years of Oklahoma football now, and number 800. It's 800 wins, 302 losses, and 53 ties through the years. And Bob Stoops alluded to it there. The Oklahoma Sooners do have the winningest college football program since World War II, and that is fairly significant.